All right, so we got four tacos. The blue chief, you <laughs> We have uh, canitas, chicken, we have a pastor, and then we have the uh, asada. We are in Reno, in the city of Reno. About to get some tacos at the taco shop. We're gonna start off with the asada, because, you know, we gotta test out the uh, bowl sander first. That sounds good. It's really good meat. It's nice chunks of it. Yeah. You can tell it's marinated like como que la what is it marinaron? La marinaron? Yeah. Desde con tiempo porque está bueno. Yeah. It's got a different flavor to it. It doesn't taste like you, they just played something on it. Como que no le pusieron nada más algo así como que la marinaron. Yeah. La dejaron desde un día antes yo creo. It's really fl flavorful. Mucho sabor. Mm -hmm. Everything's good. Yeah, the right amount of onions, cilantro, marinated meat, tortilla is really good, nice and soft, it's hot. Man, it's a really good taco. Que le gustó, que no le gustó. Está bueno. ¿No le gustó? Sí. Yeah. Está bien surtido para, para una sola tortilla, está, tiene mucha comida. Make sure you stay tuned for at the end of the video uh, to get the score. If you like tacos, give the video a thumbs up, subscribe. What's it I'm going to taste the canitas myself. Yeah, it's not 100% how I like the taste of the canitas, but no, these are good. But it's got a good flavor to it. Yeah, for sure. Mine's falling apart. Yeah. Okay. Mine's falling apart. Mm. Mm. That's a legit canitas taco right there. It's a good amount of meat. It's colored right. It's got the right color to it. Looks good. Mm -hmm. It's a good taste to it. So far, they're, they're doing really good. A little bit, huh? Mm. Yeah, really good. Mm. Yeah, they're both really good. Yeah. Next one, we're gonna go with chicken. It's, a good, it's got a little bit of flavor to it. I don't necessarily taste a huge flavor bomb. That's what you got right there. So it looks like. Tampoco se goza eso sí. No está como más seca ahí. It's, it's dry in my mouth. You know, I'm kind of like struggling to, uh, you know, push it down. But it's not bad. It's not great. Not bad. Let's see what this also. Which is also good. Yeah, okay. Yo le puse, pero está seco. Yeah, it's not. It's not as uh, as juicy as we want. Hope. It's a little dry. Está muy horcón. Tiene buen sabor. Sí, pero. Pero no está muy jugoso. No. Yeah. Yeah. That's a big chunk of uh, chicken right there. Mm -hmm. It's like they're trying to marinate it, but it just it, it didn't. Uh, they didn't do it right. Do it right because you can see all, it's still dry. Next, we're gonna go with the al pastor. Al pastor is looking different, a lot different than we normally get it. I think this is pineapple. Is this pina, right? Sí. It's like they cooked mm -hmm. the pineapple. With, yeah, it's pina. Mm -hmm. It's like they cook, they cooked the pineapple with the uh, meat, and the meat looks a lot. Is that a different look to it than uh, what al pastor is supposed to look like? But we're gonna see right now. We're gonna find out if it's uh if it's okay. We're gonna see if they, they got it right. Mm. No está bueno. No, it's bueno. Si sabe si sabe a piña. It's weird, it's like It's got a good flavor to it, but the, the residue after you finish eating it, there's like a como seco, it's like como, grease or something, como grasa. Como algo. algo. Yeah, like, algo le queda en la, en la, en la boca. Yeah. Como it's, it's masa, weird. como. No, it's como grasa. Can you say Algo se siente. Yeah, you, you feel something. It's like grease or something left over, like no. residue, like a film of it. It's got a good flavor to it, but it's just weird, a weird sensation after you finish eating the. The meat and the pineapple. Algo, algo. Yeah, pineapple is built into it, like <laughs> built into it. It's uh, cooked into it. You can see right there. 
Actually, I like it. Me gusta así que lo pusieron así. Uh -huh. Me gustaría más, más fresco que así cocinado. Yeah, when it's cooked like this, it takes away that freshness of the pineapple because it's not so fresh like if it was in pieces without cooking it. Cook, there's like a different flavor to it, which is good. Uh, I guess it, it works still, but it's not as good as if it was like fresh cut uh, pineapple, which is what I prefer. And then, like I said, the weird thing is the the, the film that it gets left over after afterwards. It's enjoyable while you're eating it, but afterwards, it's like like what is that, right? It's weird. Right, ¿Qué pasó? El de asada estuvo bueno. Yeah. El de carnitas tenían el sabor y, y estaban buenas también yeah. las carnitas. Yeah. El de pollo estaba muy seco. Yeah. And it, and it lacked a little flavor. No, y no el sabor, sabor no, yeah. no, 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 no. It had bueno. some, some flavor to it, but not enough to, for it to be like, you know, oh, this is like really good. Like, you know, it's worth the, the dryness. It, it, wasn't, it wasn't juicy. El de... Al el del pastor te queda una sensación como no sé si sea grasa no sé cómo cómo explicar el so we agree first we're gonna go with the asada number two we're gonna go with the uh, canitas tres el pollo o la pastor mm, el... I'm gonna go al pastor o oh, sí el pastor al tercero Third, we're gonna go out with salt, and then fourth, we're gonna go with uh, the chicken. The chicken was just not, it was just not, didn't have enough flavor, and it was just too dry. Well, be like, I can meet, uh, be like, yeah, I can meet those little tacos. No, really? No. I would go back just for the asada and the uh, um, carnitas. They were really good. So, in terms of the score for Taco Shop in Reno, Nevada, we are going to go with an 8.6 for the uh, asada taco, gold standard. Taco Shop, Taco Whisperer, Chief, Mama Whisperer, we are out. See you guys. Bye. Adios. Adios. <laughs>